There's nothing better than binge watching our favorite shows. There's TV literally everywhere we look. The audiences are huge and production companies continue to throw more and more money into creating the best film they can create. However, nothing attracts more fans than their favorite actor starring in a movie or show. That's why actors are getting paid more and more over the years as watch time increases drastically from these movies and shows. These stars are making so much money, you wouldn't believe it. However, as we will find out, their money doesn't quite last forever. Here are 10 movie stars that you once loved that went broke. Some of these names you absolutely will not believe. Number 10. Heidi Montag and Spencer Pratt The reality show couple made enough money from The Hills as well as other appearances to make a whopping $10 million. Unfortunately, they were not very clever on how to spend it. It's rumored that the two were actually trying to spend all their money because they thought the world was going to end in 2012. And that probably explains the $3,500 bottles of wine they were spending their money on. The two never filed for bankruptcy, however, they did have to bring in a financial advisor when they realized they didn't have any of their $10 million left. Number 9. Erin Moran Erin Moran made a ton of money even before high school as she was a star on the TV show Happy Days. However, her happy days were coming to an end after the show ended. So did her career. She was never able to see the same type of success ever again and her money quickly diminished. Unfortunately, she passed away and it was said that when she died, she was homeless and was kicked out of the trailer park she was living in. It's unsure how much money she lost, but she was given a $1,000 check for each episode and there were a total of 255 episodes of Happy Days. Number 8. Lena Headey One of the most popular shows from the last decade was Game of Thrones, in which Lena played in. Before she took the role, Lena was going through a divorce that didn't help her bank account, to say the least. Shockingly, she was worth $5 million, but after the divorce, she said she just had $5 left in her bank account, and she often had to use credit cards to buy food for herself and her two-year-old son. Things have been going downhill for Lena, even though it's estimated she made a whopping $30 million while acting in Game of Thrones. Number 7. Tia Carrera Tia had a pretty interesting career. She acted in General Hospital and made around $150,000 a year. Unfortunately, she had a terrible boyfriend, who was also her manager. When she attempted to get out of her contract on General Hospital, the court sided with the producers, and her boyfriend took off with all of her money and she had only $300 left. She even had to sleep in the hallway of her modeling agent who felt bad for her. Luckily for her, she landed a role in Wayne's World soon after and got back up on her feet. Number 6. Gary Coleman Gary was one of the most loved child actors of all time for his role as Arnold in Different Strokes. He had gathered a fortune in acting and it was all being put in a trust fund which he was able to access when he was 17. By the time he had access, there was supposed to be $18 million in the account. However, when he finally accessed it, there was only $220,000 left. It turned out that his adopted parents were slowly draining the account over the years, and he even had to file for bankruptcy in 1999, claiming he was $72,000 in debt, mostly due to health issues. Sad that his own parents would take his money from him. Number 5. Larry King Larry King is a complete icon, so it's hard to believe that he almost lost everything. He made a huge name for himself in the 60s, but in 1971, his business partner accused him of stealing $5,000. The charges were dropped, but he was blacklisted and not able to work in journalism for four years. He suffered financially, and he was around $350,000 in debt at the time. Eventually, he was able to start working again and come back stronger than ever. Number 4. Drake Bell You may be familiar with the popular TV show series Drake and Josh. The show was a huge hit and Drake Bell was one of the star characters along with Josh Peck. The show brought Drake a huge fortune, however, it didn't last. In 2014, Drake filed for bankruptcy. He was around $600,000 in debt and even lost his $2 million home. He even rebranded himself as a Latin singer, but was never quite able to make it back up to the spotlight. Number 3. Don Johnson He was the star of Miami Vice and Nash Bridges. 
Don Johnson was one of the biggest stars known in television. However, he still found a way to go broke. He was so much in debt that he nearly lost his 17-acre Colorado ranch when he was sued by City National Bank. The bank claimed he owned around a million dollars to several businesses. These businesses included $5,000 to a spa and even $5,800 to a grocery store. Luckily for him, he was able to pay his debt just in time and keep his ranch. Number 2. Donald Trump Donald Trump is more known to be an old president better than being known for his TV work. But at one point, Trump was the star of a TV show called The Apprentice. On the show, he was known to be one of the most successful businessmen ever to live. But that's nowhere near true. Trump has never filed for personal bankruptcy, but that's because he avoids it by filing for bankruptcy on behalf of his businesses instead. And it's been quite a habit for the old president because it's happened six times already, claiming a whopping $1 billion in debt. Number 1. Nicolas Cage Nicolas Cage reportedly owed the IRS nearly $14 million and millions more to other creditors. Cage also reported that he was spending $20,000 a month to keep his mother out of a mental institution. Cage has already made a huge bounce back and was able to star in any movie that offered him a position. He spent nearly $150 million, however, just recently was able to get an Oscar nomination for his performance in Pig.